Right, and our final story for the afternoon on entertainment and celebrated South African musician Yvonne Chaka Chaka says the Ghanaian music industry can only grow if it focuses on the promotion of local artists. Speaking to Listoel Akwe, the Princess of Africa also advised local musicians to take Brandon serious in building their career. In the world of showbiz, gaining recognition on the international music scene is an achievement every musician relishes. In recent times, some musicians have blamed the underdeveloped state of the Ghanaian music industry on how stakeholder entities and other music-related associations have managed the industry. The purchasing power of music through sale of CDs, cassettes, downloads and securing artist endorsement deals have been successful due to the branding and strategic promotion of artists. For instance, the UK Department for Culture, Media and Sport revealed that the creative industry is worth £71.4 billion per year, generating over a staggering £8 million an hour. Also, a survey conducted by the Recording Industry Association of America, RIAA, indicated that the music industry as part of the creative community collectively exports more than $125 billion annually, fueling American jobs. On the contrary, the Ghanaian economy is yet to experience such compelling contributions from the creative industry. A situation the Princess of Africa, Yvonne Chaka Chaka, stated is due to the lack of promotion of artists by the local media. The musicians should be promoted at home. We shouldn't be hearing Rihanna and Beyonce on Ghana Radio or on South African Radio. We should be hearing Kojo and Twi, Becca, all the African musicians. In South Africa, we say local is lekker, means local music is the best. So if our people are promoted at home, that will make it big outside because people will hear about this artist in Ghana and they'll want to go and play music or buy their music.